Welcome to the Cosmic Journey, where we unravel the mysteries of the universe. Today, we're diving into an astronomical revelation that has astounded scientists and space enthusiasts alike. The James Webb Telescope, a marvel of modern technology, has made a groundbreaking discovery 4,000 strange galaxies at the very edge of the universe. Fasten your seatbelts as we embark on an interstellar exploration to understand what this means for our understanding of the cosmos. The story of our universe is a mesmerizing saga that dates back 13.8 billion years. At that time, the universe sprang forth from a state that was unimaginably hot and dense. This was the moment when space itself rapidly expanded. As the universe grew, matter began to cool, and the fundamental forces of nature started to emerge, setting the stage for an ongoing cosmic narrative. This remarkable event signaled the creation of the elements that would eventually form galaxies, stars, planets, and everything that has ever existed or will exist, including us. Our journey to understand the beginnings of the universe not only enhances our scientific knowledge, but also poses deep existential questions about our reality and our role in the vast tapestry of the cosmos. Theoretical models and simulations are continuously working to unravel the mysteries of this initial genesis. However, our ability to observe these early moments is hindered by the relentless expansion of the universe. Understanding the formation of the first significant structures that appeared soon after the Big Bang is crucial in clearing up the mysteries of our origins. This is the key reason why the James Webb Space Telescope was designed with such precision and care. In the quest to uncover the secrets of the early universe following the Big Bang, the James Webb Space Telescope has already brought to light baffling mysteries that are confounding astronomers. The latest discoveries from Webb have overturned what was previously assumed about the early galaxy's appearance. It was commonly thought that these nascent systems would look like spherical orbs or flat disks, similar to galaxies we see today. However, the telescope's recent images have surprised researchers by showing something much more unusual. These ancient galaxies strikingly resemble bananas. This astonishing finding is based on a thorough re-evaluation of images of 4,000 newly formed galaxies captured by Webb at the universe's infancy. If these observations withstand further scrutiny, they could radically alter our understanding of the complex processes involved in the formation and growth of galaxies. Additionally, they provide intriguing hints about the elusive nature of dark matter, a mysterious and unseen component believed to make up a substantial part of the universe. The revelations from the James Webb Space Telescope not only upend our previous beliefs, but also invite us on an exciting journey of cosmic discovery. The recent discovery that challenges our understanding of the universe is a journey of exploration where the secrets of the cosmos are waiting for those bold enough to seek them. What makes this discovery even more fascinating is the skepticism it faces from many astronomers. This skepticism persists despite earlier indications from the Hubble telescope, which had suggested that the earliest galaxies might be pickle-shaped. Dr. Alan Dressler, a prominent figure from the Carnegie Observatories who contributed significantly to the development of the James Webb Space Telescope, remains doubtful about these new findings, despite not being directly involved in this particular research. I retain some skepticism about this result, given the difficulty in making such measurements, especially for galaxies that are far away, small and dim, he stated. Despite the skepticism, the research team has been meticulously investigating the three-dimensional shapes of galaxies by statistically analyzing their two-dimensional projections in the sky. If these ancient galaxies were spherical or disk-shaped and randomly oriented in space, astronomers would expect that sometimes they would present their full face, appearing round and circular when viewed through telescopes. In the observations gathered by telescopes, the data is not aligning with the expected pattern. Instead, astronomers are frequently finding a plethora of shapes that resemble cigars and bananas. They consistently appear very linear, explained Dr. Pa, the study's lead author. Many of these galaxies exhibit multiple bright clumps, arrayed like pearls on a string. 
In today's universe, such elongated galaxies are rare, yet they constitute an astounding 80% of the galaxies in the Cosmic Evolution Early Release Science Sample, which looks back to about 500 million years after the Big Bang. The mass of these unusual galaxies suggests they might be the forebears of galaxies like our Milky Way, hinting that our galaxy too might have experienced a phase of elongation or a surfboard-like shape in its past. In the contemporary universe, galaxies generally fall into two primary shapes, featureless rounded clouds known as ellipticals and flat, wispy disks like the Milky Way. These early galaxies, however, did not start their cosmic journey in these familiar forms. Back in 1926, Edwin Hubble developed the Hubble Sequence, a classification system that divided galaxies into three main types, ellipticals, lenticulars, and spirals, based on their appearance. Jumping to more recent times, in 2010, a group of European astronomers utilized data from the Hubble Space Telescope to conduct a comprehensive survey of galaxy types and shapes. This survey spanned a timeline from before the existence of Earth and the Sun up to the present day. The team examined 116 local galaxies and 148 distant ones. Their findings revealed that the Hubble sequence, as it appeared 6 billion years ago, was markedly different from what astronomers observe now. Surprisingly, there were many more peculiar galaxies back then than there are today. This suggests a significant transformation over the past 6 billion years, where these peculiar galaxies evolved into normal spiral galaxies, painting a more dynamic picture of the recent universe. The astronomers propose that these peculiar galaxies transformed into spirals primarily through processes of collisions and mergers. While it was widely believed that galaxy mergers had notably decreased about 8 billion years ago, this new evidence indicates that mergers continued to occur frequently beyond that point, possibly up to as recently as 4 billion years ago. This study also supports the idea that spiral galaxies are relatively young in the cosmic timeline, indicating they have not been in existence as long as other galaxy types. Fast forward to the present, where the James Webb Space Telescope is revolutionizing our understanding of cosmology. Its latest discoveries are challenging our established views of the universe. The standard model of cosmology posits that galaxies evolved gradually over time. Initially, they formed from immense clouds of primordial hydrogen and helium, and due to the dense conditions of the early universe, galactic collisions and mergers were frequent. These events are believed to have imparted rotations to galaxies and led to the formation of disks and spirals. All these processes are thought to take considerable time, leading to the expectation that spiral galaxies would be common in the local universe, but rare in the distant, early universe. A team of scientists has now analyzed data from the Cosmic Evolution Early Release Science Survey, conducted by the James Webb Space Telescope. They have identified 873 galaxies, each with a mass greater than 10 billion solar masses and redshifts ranging from 0.5 to 4. These redshifts suggest that the galaxies are aged between 5 billion and 12 billion years, covering the spectrum from early to modern galaxies. Among these galaxies, 216 were classified as the researchers identified several galaxies as spirals, but they cautiously noted that some of these might be merging galaxies that were misclassified. Nevertheless, 108 of the galaxies were consistently classified as spirals by all evaluators. When these galaxies were organized by their redshift, the team observed that although the proportion of spirals decreased with increasing distance into the past, the number of spirals at redshifts above Z equals 3 was unexpectedly high. A redshift of Z equals 3 corresponds to about 11.5 billion years ago. After calibrating their observations, the researchers discovered that approximately one-fifth of the galaxies at Z equals 3 are spiral galaxies. These findings suggest that these early galaxies must have developed into spirals less than 2 billion years after the Big Bang. This timeline leaves relatively little time for mergers and collisions to be the sole cause of their formation. Therefore, it appears that many galaxies 
evolved into disc-shaped spirals earlier in the universe's history than previously thought. While collisions and mergers certainly play a role in the formation of spiral galaxies, it seems likely that other factors are also influential. In the ongoing endeavor to decode the mysteries of the cosmos, the James Webb Space Telescope has. The James Webb Space Telescope has risen as an extraordinary instrument, surpassing expectations and reshaping our comprehension of the early universe. Its revolutionary discoveries have ignited the imaginations of astronomers and fueled a cosmic curiosity without limits. We invite you to share your thoughts by leaving a comment. For more insights to quench your cosmic curiosity, subscribe to Cosmos Prodigy, where the universe, the James Webb Telescope, often hailed as the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, represents a giant leap in space observation technology. Designed to look further into the universe than ever before, this telescope uses advanced infrared technology to peer through cosmic dust and gas. Its primary mirror, spanning 6.5 meters, allows it to capture unprecedented views of the universe. In this segment, let's explore the engineering marvels behind this telescope and how it has opened new windows into the cosmos. Moving deeper into our cosmic quest, we come to the recent awe-inspiring discovery, 4,000 strange galaxies at the edge of the universe. These galaxies, observed as they were billions of years ago, provide a glimpse into the universe's early stages. This segment delves into the significance of this discovery and how it challenges our existing knowledge of galaxy formation and evolution. Why is this discovery so important? It's not just about the number of galaxies. It's about what these galaxies tell us about the universe's history and future. In this part of our journey, we'll examine the scientific implications of finding such a vast and varied collection of galaxies. From understanding the rate of cosmic expansion to unraveling the mysteries of dark matter, these galaxies hold the key to many unanswered questions in astrophysics. No scientific endeavor is without its challenges, and the observation of these distant galaxies is no exception. This segment focuses on the technical and observational challenges faced in identifying and studying these galaxies. We'll also discuss the limitations of our current technology and what future advancements are needed to further our understanding of these celestial bodies. As we near the end of our intergalactic journey, it's time to look ahead. What does the discovery of these 4,000 galaxies mean for the future of space exploration and astronomy? This final segment will explore the upcoming missions and technologies that may expand our knowledge of the universe even further, building on the incredible foundation laid by the James Webb Telescope. Infrared technology is the cornerstone of the James Webb Telescope's ability to observe distant galaxies. This segment delves into how infrared observations differ from visible light observations and why they are crucial in studying the early universe. Dark matter and dark energy are two of the most mysterious aspects of the universe. In this segment, we'll explore how the discovery of these 4,000 galaxies might shed light on these enigmatic components of the cosmos. We'll delve into current theories about dark matter and dark energy and how new observations could lead to breakthroughs in our understanding. Following the success of the James Webb Telescope, what's next for space telescopes? We'll discuss the big questions in cosmology that these galaxies could help answer. The impact of these discoveries extends beyond the scientific community. This segment will discuss the educational and inspirational aspects of such astronomical achievements. We'll explore how these discoveries inspire future generations of scientists and stargazers and their role in STEM education. One of the most intriguing questions in astronomy is whether there is life in other galaxies. This segment will explore what the discovery of these 4,000 galaxies might mean for the search for extraterrestrial life. We'll discuss the conditions necessary for life and whether any of these newly discovered galaxies could potentially host life forms. Finally, we reflect on the philosophical and cultural implications of discovering such a vast and varied universe. This segment will delve into how these discoveries challenge our place in the cosmos and influence our cultural and philosophical understanding of the universe. 
Spectroscopy is a key tool in analyzing the light from distant galaxies. In this segment, we delve into how spectroscopy is used to decipher the chemical composition, temperature, density, mass, and relative motion of these galaxies. Understanding these aspects provides insights into the processes occurring in the early universe and helps us piece together the cosmic puzzle. The Cosmic Microwave Background CMB radiation is a relic from the Big Bang, offering a snapshot of the universe just 380,000 years after its inception. This segment explores how the CEMB radiation helps in understanding the properties and distribution of these 4,000 galaxies, providing a link between the early and modern universe. Gravitational lensing, a phenomenon predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity, has become an essential tool in studying distant galaxies. This segment will discuss how gravitational lensing has allowed astronomers to observe the most distant galaxies by bending and magnifying their light, providing unique insights into the mass distribution of the universe and the nature of dark matter. Many galaxies, including some of the newly discovered ones, host supermassive black holes at their centers. This segment will explore the role of these black holes in galaxy formation and evolution, their influence on their host galaxies, and what they can tell us about the universe's broader workings. The discovery of these galaxies also contributes to our understanding of the universe's expansion. This segment will discuss Hubble's law, the rate of expansion, and how the study of these distant galaxies provides clues to the universe's ultimate fate. We'll explore the concepts of an accelerating universe and the potential for new physics beyond the current cosmological models. As we push the boundaries of space exploration, the quest to find the earliest galaxies continues. This segment will discuss the ongoing efforts to observe galaxies from the cosmic dawn, the period when the first stars and galaxies formed. We'll explore the challenges involved and the potential revelations from such discoveries. Galaxy clusters and superclusters represent the largest structures in the universe, in this segment, we'll explore how the study of these structures, especially in relation to the newly discovered galaxies, helps us understand the large-scale structure of the cosmos and the role of dark energy in shaping the universe. Dark matter, though invisible, plays a critical role in the formation and evolution of galaxies. This segment will delve into how the discovery of these galaxies provides new insights into the nature of dark matter and its interaction with visible matter in the cosmos. What lies ahead for deep space missions following these discoveries? This segment will look at planned missions and the future of space exploration, focusing on how they aim to build on the achievements of the James Webb Telescope and further our understanding of the universe. Redshift is a critical concept in understanding the universe's expansion and the evolution of galaxies. This segment will delve into how redshift measurements of the newly discovered galaxies help us map their distance and speed, offering insights into the universe's expansion history and the dynamics of cosmic evolution. Cosmic dust plays a pivotal role in the formation and evolution of galaxies. In this segment, we explore the composition and function of cosmic dust in the newly discovered galaxies, examining how it contributes to star formation and the development of galactic structures. Star formation rates in galaxies provide crucial information about their history and future. This segment will discuss how studying the star formation in these 4,000 galaxies can reveal the processes that govern galactic growth and evolution, shedding light on the life cycle of galaxies in the universe. Galactic collisions and mergers are common in the universe and play a significant role in shaping galaxies. This segment will explore how the study of these processes in the newly discovered galaxies helps us understand their structural evolution and the formation of galactic features like spiral arms and elliptical shapes. Dark energy remains one of the most mysterious aspects of the universe. This segment will delve into how observations of these distant galaxies contribute to our understanding of dark energy, its role in the universe's accelerating expansion and its influence on the fabric of space-time. The discovery of these galaxies has spurred advancements in astrophysical modeling. In this segment, we explore how these models are being refined to accommodate new data, leading to more accurate simulations of galaxy formation, 
evolution, and the overall dynamics of the universe. Cosmic radiation, including gamma rays and cosmic rays, impacts galaxy and star formation. This segment will discuss the role of cosmic radiation in the universe and how it affects the physical processes within these newly discovered galaxies. Welcome to Blessovia Science TV, where we take you on an exhilarating journey through the cosmos and unravel the mysteries of science. We are excited to offer you the opportunity to become a valued member of our ever-growing community of cosmic enthusiasts and knowledge seekers. Exclusive access to cosmic content. As a member of Blesovia Science TV, you will gain exclusive access to a treasure trove of cosmic content, including documentaries, interviews with leading scientists, space missions updates, and awe-inspiring visualizations of the universe, live Q, and as sessions with experts. Your membership will grant you the chance to participate in live Q and a sessions with renowned scientists, astronomers, and space explorers. Get your burning questions answered by those who push the boundaries of human knowledge. Embark on a journey that spans the cosmos and join us in unraveling the secrets of the universe. Become a Blasovia Science TV member today and together we will reach for the stars. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and share. Don't forget to leave your comment.